Look like you lost 10 pounds fast. My top five tricks for dropping water weight. If you remember back in my Candid About Keto post, I explained the different mechanisms at play in weight loss success with a keto diet, and I told you I'd create a mini-series on how to create those effects without tying yourself to the dangers of keto. So here's weight loss mechanism number three, dropping water weight. Now, if you missed weight loss strategy number one or number two, make sure you click on the actual post and you will be able to get the freebies on calorie deficits and blood sugar solutions. If you weigh yourself with any regularity, I am sure you have experienced it. You weigh yourself on Monday, hop on again on Tuesday, and the scale jumps four pounds. And you can't help but think to yourself, WTF. Let me start off by assuring you, you did not gain four pounds of fat in 24 hours. That is, unless you managed to eat the extra 14,000 calories it would take to do that, which I'm going to go ahead and say did not happen. So what gives? Your weight will naturally fluctuate from day to day, or even hour to hour due to how much water you are retaining. But what makes you retain water? Number one, eating too much salt. Number two, not drinking enough water. Number three, eating carbs and sugars. Number four, not eating enough protein. Number five, hormonal fluctuations. Hello, extra 10 pounds every time it's that time of the month. And number six, inactivity. Reason number three, eating carbs and sugars. Yeah, that's part of the reason people appear to lose weight so quickly on keto. By all but eliminating carbs, they're dropping water weight fast. Carb molecules bond to water molecules at a ratio of three to one. So eliminate carbs and water drops right off. But here's the thing. It is an optical illusion. You drop water weight, you look slimmer, but it isn't going to give you the long-term results you're looking for. But I get it. Sometimes we have a wedding, a vacation, a reunion, or a photo shoot that we really do need to slim down for as much as we can, as quick as we can. That's where water weight manipulation does come in handy. But before I give you the goods on exactly how to look as tight as possible, as fast as possible, I need you to understand, this is not meant to last. When you follow my guide and see the scale drop down, you are not allowed to get discouraged when it comes right back up when you go back to more regular habits. These tactics are meant as a short-term solution only, one week max, and you should always consult a doctor before starting any new diet regimen. So here we go, your top six tips to dropping water weight and looking lean on the quickness. Number one, drink 100 ounces of water per day. I know it seems counterintuitive, but not drinking enough water signals your body to hold on to it. Number two, eliminate processed carbs, added sugars, and grains. Keep your carbs coming from veggies and limit to one serving of fruit per day. Sweat it out. Get your cardio workouts in, hit the sauna, train in sweats. Just pay attention to your body and make sure you don't overheat. Eat lean protein with every meal and snack. Eliminate added salt. Eliminate caffeine and dehydrating alcohol. That means all alcohol. Want my Slimming Foods cheat sheet to see exactly what foods, herbs, and drinks will help you drop water weight even quicker? Download your free cheat sheet on the blog post. Link is down below.